Hi, welcome Bridge fans. You're here tuning in for the first match of this month's uh, Bean Swiss Individual. The idea being we're going to be playing nine matches over the course of the month. You can see round one here, and I'm playing uh, Zabutin, long-term rival Zabutin. There we go. Um, we're just going to be playing 16 boards of Best Hand Bridge, um, and then we're going to imp it, and then we're going to VP it. Uh, at the end of the match, there's going to be some standings. Um, you see PJ beat Rick Kieran um, by a small amount, and then... Uh, then the next round will be paired based on standings, like a normal Swiss event. The end of nine rounds, uh, whoever has won the most VPs will be the winner. So we're going to just jump in. Fifty. So Coop is fifty down at half time with. Oh wow! Keep it up, Coops. Seems good. Uh, so we're going to be playing as a Zabutin, and uh, yeah, uh, we will do our best to play some best hand bridge. Zabutin has this habit of always saying he's got a bad card. He's never got a good card. And he's, he messaged me saying he had a, a garbage fire of a card. So he might have had, but he might have also just done exactly what I'm about to do. Um, so here we go. We've got uh, a 12 count. We're going to open one of our best minor. And this is Imp, so we're going to be trying to bid games if we can. So my partner has done a negative double over there, one spade. East has shown a good raise in spades. So this makes sense because everyone, I've got 12. Everyone's going to have close to 10 points. So East has got a 10-point hand. West has got like a 9 or a 10-point hand. My partner's got like an 8 count maybe. So I'm just going to be two hearts because partner's got four hearts. I've got four hearts. I want partner to be able to compete to three hearts. If I, There's no way two hearts buys the contract, I don't think. Um, one of them will be two spades. Partner is corrected to clubs. Forcing to three hearts. That's a, oh, that's a trial bid. The partner was looking for gaming hearts. Now, they're a passed hand. I've got a 12 count. I don't think we've got a heart game on, so I'm just going to pass. And uh, my partner's on lead, thankfully. So my partner can lead whatever he, he deems best. King of clubs. Uh, this is probably from Ace King X. So... All right. Well, I'll put the king on it. The partner's got the ace king of clubs and the queen of hearts. I need to switch to a heart now, don't I? What I could do is lay down the queen of clubs. I don't think partner will realistically have five very often, but why would they switch to a diamond there? I think they were switching to a diamond to allow me to play a heart through. So that's, it's probably right to switch to a heart. And we're aiming to getting one heart, one club and one spade. So we'll play a heart. All right. I, I'd, I'd just prefer them to keep, keep cashing clubs, to be honest. Um... Oh. Ace and play clubs. Our partner has five clubs. All right. Uh, that makes sense why they switched. All right, but we're not making many more. It look, looks like they're making ten. So there's a chance that if you compete to four something, four clubs or four hearts. That Zeb has let through. And yeah, um, me switching to heart didn't actually cost a trick, I don't think. Yeah, I'm not making any more. That's not a good measure, Coops. So the other thing I could have done was play a diamond back and try and get partner diamond off. But if that's our defense, we're not beating it. Partner can't have the ace of hearts, pretty much, because they're a passed hand. So if we are going to get the king of diamonds, a diamond off, the ace of spades and two clubs, that might be enough if I play a diamond back at trick three. So I've got the ace of spades to get in with. It doesn't work because partner's got five clubs. It keeps it to nine. 
We've got 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. We've got 15, so we're going to open an O-Trump. Uh, partner's transferring to spades. I'll bid two spades now. I actually th thought that that might be West suit. Uh, three clubs is a new suit. I'm just going to bid 3M. I've got Ace, Queen of Hearts, which is likely to be West suit, and most of my points are in the suits that my partner hasn't bid, so I'm going to bid 3M. It denies club support, all right, which is definitely a mistake. However, it looks like we've missed... Well, yeah, I'm certainly we've missed six something. I think one of the black finesses are going to be on side. So we've missed six. Oh, well. Nice. Might have missed seven here. Oh, wow. Take a spade for this as well. Boop. Small. All right. Um, do I need to take another spade for this? I think I do, don't I? All right. So we're going to make the lot. That's potentially a bad one. My partner knows we've got a nine card club fit. And if he doesn't want to play in 3N, which I don't think I would with the north end. We did get them all, yeah. We took some finesses and they worked. I mean, you've got 12 cut black cards. I don't think I'd ever want to play in 3M. When partner opens a stronger chump, I'm thinking slamming spades or clubs. I think so. I think North should be four clubs over 3M. I think so too, yeah. Six clubs seems like a good shout. I could, like, so I could add the same hand. But instead of the fourth club, I could, have, you know, I could have a fourth heart. And I'm going to bid the same. It looks a bit bad that I've denied club support. What I could have done is bid four of a, three of a red suit on the way, but it might tell Wes what to lead. I don't really want a diamond lead. The diamond lead's really bad for me, isn't it? Because I haven't really got um, a second diamond stop. I actually do on the cards, but... All right, two, six, 13, 15. So we've got 15. I don't really like... Um, could open a no trump, um, but I'm not going to. Um, and a bit of club, and hopefully get chance to bid hearts. Yeah. So what do I bid here? Two hearts. Am I good enough? I'm not good enough to bid two hearts. I'm not. Can't bid a no trump. I just have to bid two clubs. I think, which I don't like. We could be missing three in here. Nope, partner has stretched the response. This is probably why I shouldn't reverse the hand I've got. So this looks pretty good. What I can try and do is either try and rough a heart in the north hand or try and set north's diamonds up. So what what do we fancy doing? If you said partner had four points as a dummy, that's a really good dummy. They've led a heart. I've got a heart roughing dummy. I mean, a third club might be nice, but... Yeah, ace. So I can always rough a um I think I'm just gonna play Queen and Rough. All right, the Jack Falls, my ten is good, so I'm probably just gonna play three rounds of clubs now. Uh, it doesn't really matter what I throw, I don't think. Right, so everything breaks. It was likely things are breaking because they didn't come in. They didn't compete. I have 15 partners got four, so they've got more points than we have. And when they don't compete, it's likely that neither of them is shot in clubs, i.e. unable to compete. I wonder if I can do quite a nice thing where I finish the contract with four tens. Do you think that's possible? So... West led from four low hearts. They did the jack of clubs. My guess is that West has the king of diamonds. Because he didn't have ace and king of spades. Because he didn't need a spade. So they've got to have some points. Let's try the queen of diamonds. Uh, low. Right. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to do it. Here we go. Uh, play the ace. 
And then play the nine. Now we're going to finish with four tens. Isn't that nice? <laughs> uh, I did this before once, actually. I made a beer card where my last four cards were sevens. In the, in the last two tricks, I had two sevens in each hand. And I had the seven chumps and the beer card in my hand. And I was able to make the last two tricks. Uh, so reds, ten, red, ten. Quads, yeah. Oh, PJ, you deserve an award, a, a thing for that. I do have a... I can't use my soundboard because I'm not... Uh, I've muted my music. That's pretty good. If you didn't see that, uh, someone in chat said it was a tens finish. I, I do like bad puns. They're good. Um, so I'm going to open a club. I'm, I'm too suited here. This is absolutely fine because I, I never have a rebid problem when I've got clubs and spades. I can always bid a club. And if I have to bid on the next round, I can nearly always bid my spades. Uh, I'm going to pass because I haven't got uh, a bid now. I could double to show clubs, I think, but I'm just going to pass. Uh, I'm going to pass. East has shown a good raise. The likelihood they both got about a 10 count. There's no guarantee three clubs plays very well, even if partner has clubs. I think if they've got an eight card spade for it, maybe even a seven card spade for it, there's a chance that a stupid partner always leading with singleton chumps. I'll play the jack. It could be that West only has four spades, but it looks like they've got five if partner's leading them. Good lead partner. They can pick them up anyway. But it's just. You're told not, you're told, like as a human, you're told not to lead singles and chumps unless it's definitely right to lead a chump. And when your bot does it, they just do it so frequently that it's just quite annoying. All right. I probably insert the king here. What I'm hoping for partner to have, a, a, like the eight, partner has the ace of diamonds, I can get a diamond rough, but nope. He's drawing yet another of my chumps. Thanks, partner. Yeah, they're going to take a finesse through me here. Yep, can't rough that. Partner's got the king of hearts here. So. All right. Um, well, three clubs actually plays quite well, doesn't it? Maybe I should have double two clubs. If I double two clubs, we might get to play in three clubs. Um, but they can always bid three spades and make it. I don't think we can do anything about it. We're, all, we're only ever going to take a diamond, two hearts, and a club, aren't we? Yeah, that's all we ever take in three spades. That might be flat. Uh, we have an 11 count, and it's gone pass pass to us. I don't really want to open this. What I could do is open a diamond and pass if partner bids a major. If partner bids a no chump. I'm fine with it. I could open a club and pass partner's bid, but it allows them to compete. And we're vulnerable. What you don't want to play is, and you don't want to play in an invite. I'm just going to pass. <clears throat> uh, have we missed four spades? No. We've got three diamonds and a heart to lose and a club, yeah, so. Uh, you are right, Vic, and a club lead three spades has problems. Oh, you mean on board four? Yeah, you might be right. It goes club, club. You got to play on diamonds, haven't you? Mm. I did. Well, partner doesn't lead a club there ever, so it doesn't matter. I think that's a, a moot point. We have fifteen and develop in a club. I'm just going to bid a heart, and then see what to do afterwards. I want to compete again, but we will see what happens. All right. I haven't really got a bid. 
This is not a good 15 because Queen Jack of Clubs are, are, are worse. My heart suit's poor. I don't think I have a bid here. Could have maybe overcalled a no chump and. That's a good dummy. I think what I do is play a heart. Now, the reason I'm going to play a heart is um, partner hasn't led one, so partner will have the ace or king of hearts here. If they've got the ace, um, West might go wrong by putting the king of hearts up, so I'm just going to play a low heart. Yeah. And I've got queen nine over the jack here. But my guess is that they had ace, ten, double turn, so I'll put the nine, I don't think it matters. My guess is that West had ace, ten, double turn, and they were trying to see if the ten held. Because I think if you had ace, ten, x, you don't play the ten, you run it. I think they're going for cross stuff, so what I'm going to do is discard the nine of diamonds. And then my, my expectation is they're going to go king of diamonds, uh, try and rough a diamond. No. So I'm going to win. If I win the ace. Yeah, let's win the ace. Let's play a spade back. And what I'm going to do if they play a club off dummy, I'm going to pitch the queen of diamonds. Uh, no. Nope. They're going to rough a diamond. Yeah. They're going to rough a club, yep. Yeah. They're going to draw my trump, yep. And then they're going to, it depends if their diamond's higher than my partner's diamond. Which it is. All right. I don't feel this has been a good set, I'm afraid. I've got 13. We are going to open this 13. We're going to open it one club, which is what we need to open when we're 4 4 in the majors. And partner shown four spades. So I'm going to bid a spade. Which has only three plus spades. I'm going to do a spade. And I kind of want to defend hearts, so let's pass. Partner's had a singleton, naturally. All right, so they've got six hearts. Um, I'm going to make these anyway, so I guess we just play a low spade and hope they guess wrong. Let's play a low spade. Yeah, ace. Yeah, got, so they guessed wrong there. So what we do is I can cash two hearts. Yeah, for best on bridge, I'm doing a lot of defending. So I think what I need to do is knock out the ace of diamonds so that he can't cash too many tricks here. But I think they just pitched two diamonds and ace king of clubs. Yeah, I'm just going to make two hearts now. They're going to throw all their losers away before I get a chance to rough and cash a diamond. They might have the king of diamonds anyway. They didn't. His partner did. Yeah, I'm going to make two hearts and then uh, they're going to make the last trick with a heart. Uh, at least they got the spades on. So we gained a trick there, potentially. That, feel that feels good. we got 12 here. We're going to open this a heart. And there we go. Oh my god, another defensive hand. Do I bid three hearts? I, I'm just scared if I bid three hearts, they bid four. It shows six. I'm just going to pass. Thank you, partner. I kind of want it to be in three hearts, but if I bid it, partner raises to four a lot of the time. Now, if they lead fourth highest, I should play low here and then try and finesse the spade later. Uh, there's a chance. What's going to happen is East is going to win the spade and play a diamond through. All 
All right, I need to get to them to take a heart finesse. So let's play the 10. If they duck, I'm just probably... Am I going to finesse? East has shown up with the King of Spades and the Queen of Diamonds. But East did bid clubs. And West doubled as a passed hand. So West has also got clubs and... Well, shot in hearts. One, two, three, four, five. I think they rise with ace of clubs if they've got it, don't they? Because there's a chance East has five. So I think I'm just going to go low. Oh dear, have they got both? You can't have both, surely. Okay, we rough. We need to take a, a heart finesse. So, uh, is, do you think? I need to find out what the Ace of Clubs is. Let's see if we can find out what the Ace of Clubs is. Ah, Steve. Oops, I played the king. So, it, West has shown up with Ace of Clubs, King of Diamonds, Queen of Spades. They can't have the King of Hearts. We play a spade to the nine. Play the jack. We need to retain the lead in the north hand. We we'll play the ten. Is the hearts four nil? The four nil. All right. All right. So there's nothing I can do because I couldn't get. To, well, I could get to me twice. I need to get the clubs right. I think. So I've gone off here. The duck of the club was balmy. I could have a singleton. Like, it was really balmy. I played the 10, not the jack. I could have a singleton because their partner has bid three clubs. Makes no sense. They get a, obviously, if they fly ace of clubs, it's easy. When they didn't fly ace of clubs, I just didn't, couldn't imagine they'd have ace to four and not play the ace. Right. So, we're not doing very well. I can see why Zeb said um, he'd not had a good set here. But I don't think I've got any... Many positive positions. I think maybe I've saved the trick on board seven. Zeb might be in three spades going off on board five. Not much, is there? I played board two, three okay. Didn't miss game. So, partner's opened and we have 16. So, we're going to gain force with two diamonds. Partner's got diamond support. I actually really like my hand. Jack of spades is a really big card. In fact, I've got five diamonds. I've got controls in every suit. I am just going to bid key card, and this might be a bit pushy. Mainly because I don't really like bidding slams with the bots. Let's bid, at least find out whether we've got enough. If partner's got two, we're not too far. Partner's got three, so I'm probably just going to bid. Uh, do I find out about the queen? Partner's got to have three, surely. One, two. I don't think there's a bother looking for the queen of diamonds, mainly because... Um, I, I need to find out how the Queen of Spades is. See if seven's a good bet. I'm, I'm going to do it just in case Pat shows the King of Clubs and the Queen of Diamonds. Can they have that? I've got 16. Partner has got... So far they've got 11. King of Clubs and Queen of Spades is 16. So let's... Uh, oh no, King of Clubs and Queen of Diamonds. So that's... 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, maybe. I'm just going to be the save six times, I think. Yeah, partner hasn't got the queen, so... This seems pretty good. We can cash two diamonds and try and rough two clubs in the north, and that's how we make it. So what we're going to do, we're going to unblock the King of Clubs at trick two, and then eight. Well, this is winning, so this is even better. We've got a discard for one club. We only need to move one club. So what we need to do now is a safety play in diamonds. And I think a safety play in diamonds is an ace of diamonds and diamonds towards the nine. You definitely need to cash the ace first, because you can pick up both 4-1 breaks that way. So we're going to play the ace of diamonds in case diamonds are 4-0, sorry. And... Um, 
And it's the counterintuitive play. Whenever you've got king nine to an ace jack, to, usually you've got king nine to four and ace jack to four. Um, the safety players would play the ace and small towards the nine. Um, in this particular case, we're trying to avoid queen ten to four in either hand, and the only way to do that, if you play a diamond to the king, you lose queen ten to four with west. So you've got to start with the ace of diamonds. All right, and then play a low diamond to the king. And then we lose uh, a diamond in the end, so we can see the diamond, but we should be able to make everything else, so that's fine. Yeah, it possibly was worth it. With my human partner, I probably wouldn't have jumped a key card, but... I didn't really need to know anything else other than key cards. My partner's got two. Four ends still fine, isn't it? As long as I've got four diamonds. All right, that might... I don't think that'll be good. I think Zeb will get there as well. Um, but we will see. 6, 12, 13, 14, 15. We've got 15... Uh, we could have a call now, Trump. I don't really like it um, with just ace, x, of hearts. They're always going to lead a heart, and I can't hold them up. I can't hold up the heart. So I think what I'm going to do is make an off-center double. I'm going to show four spades and a decent hand. So it could be right to bid a no Trump, but I'm going to double. Jump in two spades. So I'm going to be four spades. If partner can jump to two spades, I'm absolutely delighted to bid four. Even if we're a bit light, things like the king of diamonds are going to be on side more often than not. Uh, so, do we need to diamond finesse? Uh, we don't, do we? We can just rough a heart and a club in the south and taking the diamond finesse uh, could be risky. It could give us our fourth loser. So what we just need to make sure is that chumps aren't breaking poorly. So we're going to play the ace. And we're going to play one spade. And then what we're going to do effectively is draw the last trump and concede two clubs and a heart and then rough North's losers in the south end. We're not going to take the diamond finesse. So we're going to draw the last trump. And we're going to concede one heart and two clubs, but then south can rough two of North's losers and the ace of diamonds covers the other one. So we're going to concede three tricks and make it. Yeah, the king down's on side, so potentially... Uh, it can't be roughed out, so you don't actually gain by taking the diamond finesse. But if it was king x or king third with east, you could make another trick. Uh, we have 9, 15. So we're going to open a no jump. Partner's double stamen. I am just going to do two spades. Yeah, I don't know what's going on here. West has got a suit and East has got hearts. So my guess is that West has diamonds and East has hearts. That would be my guess based on my hand. And based on dummy as well, I think this is going to get roughed. It's going to go king of hearts, ace of hearts, heart back roughed. Uh, or oh, diamond through. So we're going to go off here because they're going to play a diamond back at trick two. Um... Yeah, rough, and they're going to play ace on the diamond, gets roughed. Yeah. Yeah, so one off. It would be two off if the jack of spades doesn't fall down. So they didn't play another one back. It probably means East has the jack of spades. Um, and East can't envisage uh, West ever roughing me. So um, my guess is that's the case, or East has four spades initially or something. So we're going to play one top spade and claim. Yeah, and then spades are breaking, so we can just claim now. Yeah, so east had the jack of spades. Not much I can do there. Three ends by me might... Uh, does it have play? Not really. Oh, actually, it does, because they, they've both got singletons, so they can't set their suit up. West can, can't set their diamonds up. And we make four spades, three clubs, one heart. Oh, I think we're a chick short, are we? We make four spades, 
three clubs and one heart. Yeah, I think you're right. You might be able to throw West in to give you the King of Diamonds or something. Well, the thing is, when East wins the heart, plays a diamond through, what does West do? Does West cash them or not? If they cash them, they give you the ninth. If they don't cash them, you might be able to throw them in with the fourth club. Yeah, I think so. My guess is that when East wins the heart, they play a diamond through. Now, East... But your heart pips, you can actually set... If they don't cash the diamonds, you, your heart pips are good enough for you to set a heart chick up. So if they don't cash your diamonds, you just play on hearts. If they do cash your diamonds, I think what you have to do is then play West to lead a diamond trick, whatever. Anyway, we have 23 high card points here. So we're going to open two clubs and bid 2N. That's just 22, 24, I think. Yeah, 22, 24. We're banging in the middle of that. It'll be 2M. Partner bids 3N. Pass. At least it's game. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. We've got nine top tricks. Um, and like, we can't afford to lose a lead because hearts are wide open. Hearts could be four for them. So what we're going to do is cash four diamonds because they can see that threat. Um, we'll see what they throw on the last diamond. I'm going to throw a heart away because there's no way my queen X of hearts is ever going to transpire into a heart stop. And then what I'm looking for them to do is one of them to throw a spade from jack to four or something. So my ten of spades wins. Um, so we play four rounds of diamonds. Uh, east to a heart away. East to a club away. East to another club away. So East has sent two clubs away. Do I play on clubs first? I don't think I can play on clubs first because if the Jack of Spades falls double turn, I need the clubs as an entry to untangle things. So I am going to play on Spades first, even though. If clubs are now breaking... Oh, hang on. We can check that count theory as well to see if Gib gives count. So at the end of the hand, we're going to look to see if he started with five hearts because they threw the three hearts around the first discard. And I'm going to claim no more tricks. So let's have a look at this theory. There's a theory that the, the computer gives count, um, which we weren't aware. So that is one in favour of they do give count. So that's what we're looking for today, potentially. The first discard was the three of hearts, which is count for hearts. So we're going to watch this. Um, right, but we made game, that seems fine. 5, 10, 18 we've got. We're going to overcall a heavy 1N. This is a pretty pretty on the maximum side for this, but what I don't want to do is double and bid 2N with this hand. My Jack of Diamonds isn't really pulling full weight, so I'm just going to bid a no trump. 3, then 9. Yeah, I'm just gonna, for, for the moment, my theory is just going to check first discard only. I think. Three clubs transfer to diamonds. What? What? Why do I want to play three diamonds? That makes no sense. They're trying to get me to play in three diamonds, are they? I'm going to break... I, bleh, I do not like this. I'm going to break it to 3M. Um, I don't want to be stuck in three diamonds. Well, maybe that was the right thing to do. All right, so yeah, we're in trouble here. It just seems like, why would you... Tra You're transferring me to their suit. Like, East could have five diamonds. Well, not really, but you get the idea. I mean, East could still have five diamonds here. So, do I duck this? Yeah, let's duck this. We play a small spade. Yeah.
All right, we're getting lots off here. This just makes no sense. We're in ace, and then we play a club to the 10. And play a diamond off, east inserts. Oh my god, is West got a stiff on her? Has West got a singleton diamond on her? Why would East not insert here? East would surely insert if they could, so I'm going to try. Alright, I don't get it. All right, they, that was fine. Um, East only has three diamonds. So obviously, playing in three diamonds is the correct choice on the hand. But All right, let's see what their first discard was. Uh, now I'm only going to do it on the hands where they discard early. Thanks, Vic. He showed up with King of Spades, King of Hearts, and Ace of Clubs. Can't have both diamond on us. Why? Why can't they? Oh, because that would give them a strong low trump. They could have king-queen to five. They could have king-queen to five in a stiff club, couldn't they? At that point, I... Oh, I know they've not got a stiff club. Yes, I know they've not got... Yeah, you're absolutely right. So Vic says they've shown it with both major suit kings and ace of clubs. And once they show up with two clubs, you know they've got to be balanced. Yeah, four two five two. yeah. But they would insert with both of them. They would. They just they just would at that point because it's the setting trick. Six, ten, twenty. This has been a pretty poor set, but Zeb said he'd done pretty poor, so. Alright. Have you actually got a spade stop on her? Pass. Thankfully, thankfully, East only has one spade here. So, five, six, seven, eight, nine. We just need to set clubs up. I think what I'm going to do is just cash five hearts first. Just in case. I could have ducked that. Might be safer, but against a human, you might have to duck that. I think I took twice as long to play Zabutin as I took to play PJ. Mingola. Yeah, well I'm streaming it, Brad. That's doesn't that's not fair. Um So I think this might be an end play here. Whoever wins the second diamond has to give a trick away here. So we play Ace of Diamonds. Diamond. Uh, okay, no, no end play. Because uh, they've got a club to cash on the King of Diamonds. Nope, alright, well we made it. But I much prefer a takeout double of three spades from the north end. Four hearts could be the right place to play. I might not have a spade stop. All right, we've got a 10 count and six spades. Now, I think I'm going to make a, a weird two spade bid here. Oh, so Vic said count checks out. So let's just check this. And then a heart. Yeah, so you can see here that East is just throwing their lowest diamond away. 
And West is actually playing a high spade, so they're giving count. I think they are actually giving count in defence. Early in the hand, they're giving count. Mm, that's three for three for three so far. Mm. I'm going to put two spades on the basis that they're not going to come in. And this stops partner inviting game, I think. I don't think it's right to pass this out. And knowing everyone's got to exactly 10 points, I think two spades is fine. So yeah, we've got... Oh my God. <laughs> we missed game. We haven't, I think. Oh, no, we're just not quite. Yeah, I only... Someone said it in an article on Bridge Winners that um, they play count in defence. It's one of the articles that, that uh, Cool Beans told me to read or, or at least posted. Uh, it looks like we're going to make nine here, by the way. We're going to get to Ruffer Diamond in the north end. We've got Ace, King of Clubs, and then six spades. Uh, well, this is this is a no-cost discard, I think, just in case they've underled. Um, no, it might be better to squeeze West. If West has Ace, King of Hearts, and five clubs, we can squeeze them. So let's go for a squeeze, because we haven't had a squeeze today, have we? Um, and they, 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 they break it up when I lose a diamond. When I can see the diamond, they can break a squeeze up. So my best bet for 10 is to just discard. All right. Oop. All right, and we just claim the rest. All right, one board to go. Um, if I have one, I don't think it's by much. It doesn't feel like a... I think we're playing best on bridge and half my scores are negative and I missed a slam on board too, which might be my fault. Got a spade pass pass to me. I have 14. I'm just going to bid a no chump, which shows a weak no chump and a spade stop. And there we lie. Uh, okay. So I think one, well, this is, we miss three N here, maybe. I could try the Queen of Spades to trick one, but if that loses to the King and he says Jack 10 to 5, that's really bad. I think it's safe to play a low spade of dummy at trick one. Um, because I still have a spade stop. The only advantage for playing the Queen of Spades at trick one is you're in the right hand to play a club finesse. So we'll play low. And then we want to take a club finesse. So let's play down to the King. And run the Jack of Clubs. Okay, loses. Play King of Spades, yeah. Queen. And we're just going to cash some clubs. Obviously, the King was stiff. Uh, and they're gonna they're keeping the ace of hearts and winning spades. So we bad by rule. The king of clubs is always singleton, is it? I play a heart, but I think he, West has got the last three tricks here. All right, how have we done? Uh, I don't know. Not necessarily so there were some clear errors there. All right, I win by 12. Quite a flat set, actually. Um, I didn't think I'd done very well. Zeb said he'd done worse. We'll just have a look at... Yeah, obviously, board 5, you can clearly see he's standing out. And board 15. He's... I think they're both hands I, I almost passed out. Um, other than that, it's just over tricks. Biggest win for pass. It's a pretty big win for pass, isn't it? Uh, so I will I will highlight that for filthy, shall I? Cheers, thank you. So let's pop that in the bin. Swiss.
Right, so we'll pop that in the results in a sec. Um, but that's, I don't know what that is, like a 14-6 win or something? I don't know. On board five. I think, I mean, let's, so let's have a quick look at these. And if we swap to the other view and we go to this view. So, um, he made, he kept it to nine. Yeah, so you can, you, you can keep this to nine by finding a diamond rough. Yeah, board five and 15, the big ones. Uh, board three. Uh, he opened a no chump, which I, met, I briefly mentioned. Obviously, it gives him one more trick. Board five, like it's gone past past to you. Should you open that? I'm, I'm not sure. I would never. I like. I would never in playing Ackle. I would never open that in third, because the only bid I can open that in third is a weak no chump, and that is not a third in weak no chump. Um, and you got to four spades, which got whacked. I mean, spades were four nil, but even if spades are two two, you're not making it. You're gonna lose two diamonds, a heart, and a club. Yeah. So even though spades don't break on board, board one against me, you're saying my table next. Yeah, okay. It's difficult to find a rough when partner leads back with five of diamonds. I mean, they, they could have five for doubleton. They could have five for doubleton. Yeah, it's just a trick, though. Um, there were two big swings. This was this was a swing. Um, Zeb ga gains a swing here because I played in three hearts. Oh, yeah, I got the clubs on. So I can actually gain on this board because he beat four clubs. I can make three hearts. I can make two imps if I make three hearts. So... That's potentially one of my two mistakes. And then the last one, I opened two spades. He opened one spade. And gets to four spades and he gets whacked again. You are right, Vic. All right. Well, that has been the uh, Bean Swiss individual. Uh, we'll see with match one. We win the match. Our next match is against someone else who's going to be won. Tune in next time to see who I'll be playing. And again, I'll be talking through 16 boards of Best Hand Bridge. See you soon.